my name is Shelly, and I'm with Sailors for the Sea, powered by Oceana. Today we're doing one of our kids' environmental lesson plans, or kelp activities. It's called Salty Ocean. Have you ever wondered why it's easier to float in the ocean than it is to float in a swimming pool or freshwater pond? It all has to do with the salt. When salt is dissolved in water, like in the ocean, the salt adds to the mass of the water, making the water more dense than it would be without the salt. And objects and liquids that are less dense than the salt water will float on top of the salt water. So today we're going to do a really fun activity using fresh water and salt water to test this concept out with simple materials that you may already have at home. You just need two large jars, four small clear glass jars, a measuring cup and tablespoon, a stirring spoon, salt, tap water, red and blue food coloring, and two index cards. Now I've already made up these liquids for you. Our first is the fresh water, which is three cups of tap water and red food coloring. Our second is the salty water. That's three cups of water, two tablespoons of salt, and blue food coloring. Next, you fill up two small clear glass jars with the fresh water and two small clear glass jars with the salt water. And make sure to fill them all the way up to the top. And now we're going to be stacking them on top of each other. So in our first stack, we have the salt water, which is the blue water on the bottom, and then we're going to be placing the fresh water on top. This is where you take your index card, you put it on top of the fresh water, and then you gently flip over and place on top of the salt water. Now we're going to do the reverse for this stack. So fresh water on the bottom, take your index card, put it on the salt water, Gently flip over and place on top of the fresh water. Now we are ready to test the density of our liquids. What do you think will happen when I remove the index card from this first set of jars? Remember the blue water on the bottom is salt water and since it contains salt is more dense than the fresh water on top. Let's see what happens. The fresh water is floating on top of the salt water because it is less dense, just like you floating in the ocean. Now what about this second set here? You have the salt water on top this time. When I remove the index card, since the salt water is more dense, it falls to the bottom and mixes with the red fresh water, making it purple. This experiment shows that the ocean salt water is denser than fresh water. If you're interested in learning why the oceans are salty, download the full activity at our website, sailorsforthesea.org, and click on Kelp. We also have 50 other lesson plans to help children learn about our oceans. Thanks so much for joining today. See you next time.